We have farmed here since 1960. When my father moved from Montgomery County, he had farmed with his father in Montgomery County. So we've been farming this land for 52 years. I am Ed Fry, and we are at Fairhill Farm in Chestertown, Maryland. When my father, Ed Fry, also moved to Kent County, we milked approximately 80 or 90 cows. After graduating from the University of Maryland, I returned to the farm and took over the the business end of the management, and we continued to grow. We've had a lot of diversification over the years. I think that's been one key to risk management for us is that we've always been diversified. Uh, We started the organic transition on some land in 1997, and today we farm approximately 1,300 acres of organic crops. It's been challenging, but it's been a very good enterprise for us. My my involvement, I think, you know, is is a reflection of what my father was, and uh, I miss him very much. He he passed away in June, and and he was a, a leader in in the Holstein industry and, and and local organizations, and he set quite an example for me, and so that probably was the impetus behind that. And uh, I like to tell people until June of this year, I was always known as Young Ed Fry because when people would call the office, they would want to speak to Ed Fry, and, and the office manager would say, which one? And, and they would say, Young Ed Fry. And, and so uh, I'm no longer the Young Ed Fry, but, but uh, I felt like I had a real role model there. Living close to the land offers nourishment to the soul. I have come to um, absolutely love cattle. Waking up each day to see what the weather is outside, there's a real sense of connectedness to life around us. I appreciate my neighbors. We're we're milking cows about 21 hours a day. We always have cows calving and lots going on and so running 24 hours a day it means they have as many problems in the middle of the night as we do during the middle of the day and sometimes I might go a couple weeks and never get a phone call in the middle of the night which is great and then I might have a week where four nights four nights out of the week I may get a call at one o'clock in the morning with a problem that has to be fixed right then but uh, and all I, I like the hours enjoy being able to be out in the morning when the sun comes up and enjoy it. We have two little boys, Reed and Owen, and it's great because it's teaching them responsibility, it's teaching them work ethic, but at the same time we get to be together as a family and an extended family um, on a daily basis. Today the thing that inspires me is to be a strong link in a multi-generational family farming operation and uh, I have grandsons now that are too young to know what they want to do tomorrow much less what they do now but uh, it's it's satisfying to have family involved and I, I want to create a environment that is sustainable for the land sustainable for the family it's it's important to, as part of our stewardship, to be taking care of our soils and, and maintaining this soil base that for the next generation that they can make a living off of it too. It's been very satisfying to be able to do that.